The COVID-19 pandemic during the last two years demanded new and innovative ways in managing practically everything that we do. Based on the high level of infectivity of the virus, the various public health restrictions kept us apart physically. Healthcare responded to the COVID-19 pandemic through the fast adoption of digital solutions and advanced technology tools. Technology ensured communication was facilitated for coordination, implementation, and care. Traditionally, technology has made substantial and revolutionary contributions to the field of medicine by improving the quality of life in disease diagnosis and treatment. It was also utilized for communicating and engaging the public via social media. During the COVID-19 waves, the use of the Zoom and other platforms for video conferencing quickly became the norm for internal health meetings to national discussions among stakeholders and to regional and international conferences. Zoom was also utilized for health education and promotion in schools, communities, and healthcare workers. During the periods of lockdown, healthcare providers utilized telemedicine to facilitate medical checks for patients. This allowed patient reviews and prescription filling. Although there are limitations with this in relation to the physical examination and medical procedures, many patients were able to be seen remotely and others required to come in for review in certain circumstances where urgent and emergency care was necessary. Although the human touch, bedside man and doctor-patient relations can't be replaced as during a face-to-face -face doctor's visit, some level of medical support was facilitated, especially in the management of chronic health conditions. The respiratory hospital was equipped with systems to allow the remote monitoring of multiple patients by the health team. With the opening of travel and the tourism sector, the use of the digital app was utilized for the online registration of travelers. This allowed a level of pre-screening and verification of vaccine status, PCR test results, health condition, accommodation arrangements, among other information. This process was efficient and effective and reduced processing time at the ports of entry. The digital vaccine certificate is another excellent example of the use of technology during COVID-19. Globally, as countries opened up, vaccination became a requirement for access to services and travel. The use of the DigiGov electronic vaccine certificate facilitated this process both nationally and for international use. These are just a few examples. We note that although we continue to progress to normalcy, the use of technology continues to support our daily processes. They have proven to be time-saving, cost-effective, and improves the efficiency of daily processes. We anticipate the sustained use of these new technologies as we move forward. Since the declaration of COVID-19 as a public health emergency of international concern, the world has experimented with different types of technology in an attempt to control and reduce transmission of the virus. As COVID-19 continued to spread globally, our small island too looked for innovative means of managing the spread. One of the first devices considered was a tamper-proof wristwatch with the capacity to monitor the movement of individuals through geofencing. At that time, it was anticipated that this would assist in the control of persons placed in home quarantine restricting their movement and reducing further transmission of COVID-19. Around the same time, the Ministry of Health also invested in small electronic devices known as BioButtons. These devices were purchased for monitoring of signs and symptoms of COVID-19 by continuously monitoring basic vitals such as temperature, heart rate, respiratory rate, cough frequency, among others. Through early detection of signs and symptoms, timely interventions could be made, thereby facilitating prompt isolation and reduction in mortality. One of the most important and vital components of our response was and continues to be the use of GoData software. This is a tool created by the World Health Organization to manage outbreak investigations by facilitating contact tracing and data collection. The software is readily available for download and can also be used as a mobile application for fieldwork. It includes functionality for case investigation, contact follow-up, laboratory data, and data analysis. 
The beauty of this tool lies in its ability to be used during any outbreak. While the Ministry of Health continues managing the COVID-19 pandemic, all efforts are being made to modify the functionality of GoData to respond to any future outbreak.